We begin with Briggsy in the wreck. One dribble from the inbound, finding a cutter to the basket. The visionary bounce pass creates. 2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. For these two teams, two rounds down, two to go. The battle for the Eastern Conference continues. Game one of the conference finals. This is Kevin Harlan. With me tonight, Greg Anthony and Richard Jefferson. And joining us courtside, reporter David Aldrin. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. The big men on the floor for him, Giannis and Portis. Allen and Middleton are your wingmen. And it's Holiday in at the one spot. And for the 76ers. In the post, it's Tucker and NB. Harden out there with Maxi and it's Harris in at the three spot. Taking a look at Philadelphia. It was a long, cooling series for them, Greg, in the conference semifinals. Will that impact, though, their energy level tonight? Well, I mean, there's enough time between games in the playoffs with them. That shouldn't be any excuse. On their home court, they were a better team throughout the regular season. Now it's time to go out and show it. So the Bucks win the tip. So the first quarter now underway as we begin the Eastern Conference Finals. Down low. Here's Yacht. And it's off the back rim. No good. Holiday against Harden. Harris outside. To the inside. Here's MP. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two and the free throw line. That's his first personal Yeah, it's foul. such a simple yet first effective move. Embiid executing the palm fake. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. The first one falls. A scoring machine. There's just no shot Embiid's afraid to take. both and he's perfectly comfortable doing work at the line and so Giannis will bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks Portis kicks to Middleton passes it to Giannis to the paint Portis in the post guarded by Embiid Drains both of them. And about a minute gone here in the first quarter. Pass to Tucker. And here's MB. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. You just gotta admire the strength. Surprised to find himself that wide open. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. You will gladly take those. Now here is Harris. Battles 
through traffic and lays it in. And that's the physicality he has muscling through contact. Harris uses all of the tools to get his point. Allen finds out. Two minutes of play here in the first one. There's Portis, and the basket is good. Bobby Portis. Yeah, coach's pet peeve there. No box out. Uh, yeah, you think you got to stop, and it's wasted because of sloppy work in the glass. You literally practice that every day. Now here is Harris. Back to Harden. Over Holiday. Harden, no good. Credit the defensive effort there, not giving him room to operate. to Allen. Takes it inside. You know, wide open look for Portis. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Now, here's Tucker. Guarded by Holiday. Fader on the way. Here's Embiid. Kicks it out to Harden. And stolen by Portis. That's good for by Portis. Yeah, another nice bucket down low. They've really been able to work the ball into the post effectively here so far. Now here's Harden. Here's Harris. Got a piece of it. This quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. And the layup Good. call. Holiday. Oh, a nifty finisher. You didn't think Holiday would back down inside, did you? Stolen by Holiday. The pass to Portis. And it's off from three-point range. The 76ers trail by four. Harden outside. Maxi looking it over. Five to shoot. Over Allen. Another miss by Philadelphia. Fantastic positioning there to contest that one. Textbook defense. Take a good angle to the shooter and bother the release. And under the combo, slams it in. Knowing it's his responsibility to find open teammates. Holiday, nice job setting the table there. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here. They're trying to stem the tide here. On the wrong side of a scoring run here, we might see a lineup change. I'll, I'll be pretty curious. Let's take this chance now to show you the list of the postseason scoring leaders. James Harden, third, and of course Giannis. And whether it's been attacking off the bounce or pulling up. Both these guys have been lighting it up. Harden against Holiday. Maxi with it. Still without an asking. Another miss by Philadelphia. Harris against Holiday. And there's a foul. We'll go on P.J. Tucker. That's his first foul. Second team foul. Here's Holiday. Middleton flying, touches to Kumbo. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. And it's six points for Giannis. Chris the ball Middleton. movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. Harris with it. And Holiday picks him up defensively. And the basket by Harris. Harris has got his second bucket of the game to go. Leaving his defender in the absolute dust. Tobias Harris is doing everything right now. Portis, the pass to Allen. Driving to the basket. A shot by out of the Kumbo. Nobody around. And again, it's Milwaukee converted. And the crisp passing has opened things up for them offensively. Harden the pass to Embiid. This shot is good, making a perfect two for two from the floor. 
So much strength from Embiid. It would take a special defender to slow him down. Into the Kumbo inside. Embiid's there. Onto the Kumbo again. Onto the Kumbo's got 10 points. Harden against Howard. This is it to Harris. With the drive, a strong finish under heavy pressure all over. Harris has got his third basket of the night. And so onto the Kumbo will bring it up for the Bucks. Six-point lead. And Holiday kicks to onto the Kumbo. Back to Holiday. Onto Kumbo with the ball. He's against Tucker. Onto the Kumbo passes to Portis. That's good from Holiday on the assist by Portis. Assisted by and 10 of their Bobby last 12 coming off assists. For Philadelphia, they've gotten five of 10 shots to drop in this game so far. Right at the 50% mark. MB, no good. Bucks leading by eight. Now, Giannis. He's got 10. To the middle. And the dunk by Giannis. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. Yeah, they haven't appeared in a rush at all. They are just playing to their strengths and building this lead out well. Now, here's Maxi. He has yet to score on the wing, Harden. Pocket six over Holiday. And he sinks that one in the back of the rim on the way in. He just makes it look so easy on offense. It's like, who takes pleasure in torturing defenses? He does. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. You, the man for the Some changes for Philadelphia. Hamid Bamba, he's checked in for Joel Embiid. He comes in for P.J. Tucker. And it's DeAnthony Melton in for Maxi. Big group substitution here for Milwaukee. Simmons checked in for Portis. Crowder comes in for Chris Melton. Bonnie Walker, he's checked in for him. And it's Beasley in for Drew Holiday. The size of Simmons alone is what makes him so difficult to guard. Hey guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Bucks. Well, they're off to a good start getting it inside and scoring at close range. Solid fundamentals so far in this one. And another key for them tonight, attacking the basket. Taking it right to the hoop, never a bad idea. The first free throw is good. A walking triple-double threat. Simmons needs to keep working on developing that jump shot to be truly unguardable. And he makes both free throws. The 76ers trail by 10. Here's Melton. Harden outside. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. It's going to be on Malik Beasley. You got to be careful when guarding Harden. He's so crafty at finding ways to draw fouls. This is his first free throw of the game. And the first one drops. The south ball hard, lucky lefty. He's a tremendous offensive player who can pretty much get triple doubles in bunches. And both free throws good for James Harden. Bucks leading by eight. Outside, Simmons. Oh, no, no, no. 
and give him credit, Simmons struggled at the line when he entered the league, but it's really improved his foul shooting. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Ben Simmons, two shots. He can't get the first one. Good on the second free throw. The 76ers trail by nine. Harden outside. Over Beasley. It's hauled in by Giannis. They hold the early advantage on the glass. Here's Crowder. Oh, and he pucks it off the glass. Wow. Now, here's Melton. Scoreless thus far. Bamba. That misses, so no good on his first attempt of the night. Already his second oh, foul. Three. He's in danger of getting into serious foul, foul trouble early in this game. The Bucs shooting their seventh and eighth attempts at the foul line tonight. Malik Beasley taking two shots. the second yeah, you, you just have to be more disciplined I mean too many fouls and free throw attempts for the opponent Beasley against Harden has to melt kicks to Bamba pass to Harden 76ers moving the ball around just five on the clock from deep three-point land a rebound by the Bucks. No doubt it's been a bit of a struggle for him here in this quarter in terms of scoring. Count it. And then the Kumbos got 14. And their offense already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this lead. Melton feeling it out a bit inside. Two minutes. Here's Bamba. And the rejection by Adetokounmpo. Love to see Giannis get aggressive on defense, using that reach to track down the block. And the 76ers making a change here. Harrell's checked in. One fifty-two left to play in the first. Five on the clock. Harden. Adetokounmpo grabs the miss. Giannis has got four rebounds now tonight. And right from the start, Kevin, they've been pounding the glass. Most of those 50-50 balls also going their way. And it's on a bounds. The Bucks able to retain possession here. And so it's Milwaukee with it. A 12-point game. And Simmons slams it in. Their play on both ends has been superb. We, we'll see if they can maintain the momentum. They came out and bum rushed them. Huge difference in activity level from both teams tonight. It's so about it to Kumbo. On the wing, Walker. He's guarded by Melton. Walker against Melton. Walker's shot is off. Philadelphia's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. In the corner, Harden. 
good. And Harris gets the assist. Harden's got six. Just a beautiful job of scanning the floor, finding the open man. Harris looking to involve his teammates. Outside, Simmons. Shoots over Bamba. Bamba with the block. Giannis against Harris. The pass to Hero. Right wing. Bamba finds Melton. And the Anthony Melton picks up the foul. That's his first foul. He had three turnovers so far, and the real issue is the fact that they're unforced, too careless with the basketball. Bucks leading by 12. And here's Giannis. 14 points for him. And there's the drive. And good that time. 16 points for him. Displaying intensity right off the opening tip, especially on the offensive end. They came out swinging, really set the tone on offense, and the opposition has not been able to respond. And after just one quarter of play, a double-digit differential on the scoreboard. Bucks lead by 14. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. into the action here in game one. Let's see what this quarter has in store for us. Guys, we've seen the Bucks really take control here early. Well, the offense is clicking, and they seem to have seized the momentum here early on. Credit the game plan coming in. They've identified some weaknesses, and they are exploiting them. The 76ers trail by 14 on the court for the Bucks. Middleton and Giannis slot in at the small and power forward. Holiday and Allen are their guards. And it's Simmons in at the five, roaming the pit. Now here's Harrell. Nothing on the board. Four on the shot clock. Here's Maxi, And it's sent back by Allen. Oh, the lob for Simmons. And Simmons slams it in. And this is how Simmons puts up points. He challenges you close at the rim more often than not having the physical advantage. Tucker with the ball, defended by Middleton, and contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. The 76ers have been solid at the line so far. Four for four. At the line for two. P.J. Tucker. Good from Tucker. No free throws. Good from Tucker. And so it's Middleton with it. He brings it up for the Bucks. Into the lane. Shoots over Tucker. Middleton can't get it to go. That was a good look for him from mid-range, but just couldn't make the defense pay. Tucker with the ball. Passes it to MB. Back to Tucker. Maxi against Simmons. Count that bucket. Maxi's got his first two points. Maxi saying, sure, I'll take that. Holiday against Melton. Pass to Middleton. Shoots over Tucker. Middleton can't get it to go. And he felt like he needed a little bit more space with the fade to get off his shot, but that might have been what threw him off and made him miss. Embiid against Zondekumbo. Oh, Embiid just overpowers the defense inside! With inside, Embiid just has all the tools for success. The height, the power, and more importantly, the tenacity. The 
76ers trail by 10. Elton kicks it to Tucker. Over Simmons. Tucker can't get it to go. For Milwaukee, they've gotten only one of their first four shots in the second quarter to drop. Count it good. Jason. Allen's got his second Jason. basket of the night. Ben one of Simmons', Simmons. best attributes is his ability to distribute. Maxi passes to Harrell. Allen against Maxi. And he drops in the layup off the glass. That sudden move off the pick. Maxi is tough to stay with defensively. On the wing, Holiday. He's guarded by Melton. The shot by Holiday, no good. 76ers have gone three of their first five shots to drop here in the second quarter. Maxi against Zanadakumbo. And he gets the whistle three. for the three-second three. call. Well, well, Let's take a look at the players who have pulled down the most rebounds during this postseason. Third is Giannis Antetokounmpo. He's dialed up his rebounding here in the postseason. There's something about the big games that bring out the best in him. Holiday against Melton. It's stolen. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played. Off the mark, had a chance to trim it to single digits. Milwaukee leading by 10. Here's Simmons. Good, and the assist goes to Middleton. Middleton's got three assists tonight. And that's where Simmons wants to operate as a score. Foul line down. Here's Maxi. It's sent back down by Simmons. Melton kicks to Maxi. Down to five on the shot clock. He scores the basket. That's field goal number three for him. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Down low. Here's Simmons. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. And beach has got six rebounds in the game. Melton against Holliday. Had a chance there to cut it to single digits, but it's off target. Middleton left side. Feeds it to Simmons. Makes it off the glass. Simmons. Simmons got 11 points. The correct decision by Middleton. Moving to his wide open teammate, Chris. A terrific passer off the wing. Now, here's Melton. All scoring in this one. Kicks it to Tucker. Good ball movement here by the 76. Here's Maxi. It's hauled in by Giannis. I thought he had that all sewn up, but somehow the defense just threw him off. Here's Middleton, and he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. And you see Middleton on the perimeter a lot, but... He's really been trying to add strength to that 6'8 frame Chris so he can mix it up a little more inside. And that one falls for Middleton. All reads checked in for Montrez here. The Bucks also with the sub. Abby Portis is checked in for Andre Takumbo. Middleton hits them both. And here's Melton. He'll bring it up for the Philadelphia 76ers. They trail by 14. Pass to Embiid. And there's the pass to Maxi. Just five to shoot. The 76ers need to get off a shot taken away by Holiday. It's Allen on the win. And the Bucks miss again. For Philadelphia, they've gone 4 of 10 in the second quarter from the field. And they're losing their concentration here, guys. Just sloppy 
with that's the ball. His second, that's his second foul here pretty First early in this foul. one. He's got to be careful for the rest of this half. James Harden, he's checked in for Philadelphia. Crowder, he's checked in for the Bucks. Milwaukee leading by 14. Now Allen. Defensively, Embiid can take over a game with his reach. Big block from him there. The 76ers shooting struggles apparent. 37% from the field. Martin finds Maxi. Over Allen. And that one's good. Maxi. Maxi's got eight points here in this quarter. He's looking much more confident here in the second quarter as far as the scoring goes. Here's Holiday and the rejection by Harden. Shock up two there. Really? Too bad Holiday. you don't get points for degree of difficulty. Holiday showing how to handle some tight interior defense. Now here's Maxi. Eight points for him. Here's Tucker and Middleton with the block. Holiday against Harden. It's Allen on the win. The feed now to Holiday. Six to shoot. Back to Allen. Portis trying to free himself. Allen shot is off. Outstanding work to send him away. They sniffed that one out. MB dishes to Reed. Portis against Maxi. Here's MB. The big man MB converts himself. Just a late reaction there from the defense, and he is always going to finish that one. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. Yeah, this is a good opportunity to get your group together and make sure everyone is on the same page. And Philadelphia making a change here. Harris has checked in, and then for Milwaukee. Walker's checked in for Chris Middleton, and it's Malik Beasley in for Grayson Allen. Crowder, the pass to Holiday. Passes to Portis. Milwaukee needs to get off a shot here. And again, the Bucks miss. The 76ers trail by 14. Here's Harden on the win. Over Holiday. They grab their own miss. Reed misses. And the activity he shows around the rim is why he is such a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. No holding back. Embiid takes it in. The offensive arsenal of Embiid is phenomenal. He's capable of scoring and able to do the way. Right side holiday. And the rejection by Harden. Okay, so if I were to say this was a disaster of a period for him, it would be an under but hey, sometimes you've got to shoot your way out of the slump, even for him. Here's the drive. Plays it in without an inch of room around him. Harden's got eight points. Moving downhill, Harden can be so wily. Cutting through the deep, right to a shot. Holiday against Harden. Ball's not loose. Stolen by Harden. And they're on the break. Here's Maxi. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Maxi's got 11 here in this quarter alone. And he's clearly led the way offensively. The question is, can they ride him and get back into it? Beasley in the post. He's covered by Maxi. And that one is good by Beasley. And the Bucks lead by nine. Hands to Harris. Bounded by the Bucks. Outside, Walker. Over Harris. Walker's shot is off. You know, they don't score on that shot, but they're going to be happy with those kinds of possessions. Popped up there for him. Joel goes up and brings it down. I like whenever Embiid's team.
teammates use his size and throw it anywhere near the rim because he finishes it. And it's Walker penetrating for three quarters. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. And Bede's got 10 rebounds here tonight. So accurate. Here's Harris. It's rebounded by Portis. Portis has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Maxi against Beasley. 15 seconds left in the first half of basketball. That's the free fly. That's his second shot and his second basket. He's two for two. With this lead, they're playing confidently, showing a quick trigger from beyond. Pass to Embiid. Philadelphia moving the ball around. And they double up Embiid. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. Violation. That'll be a jump ball. So it's the Bucks now. And so Holiday will bring it up for Milwaukee. Ten-point lead. And Walker kicks to Crowder. Walker in the post. And Beebs there. Shots good by Walker. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. This is when good players really get after it. He can sense that they're reeling, and he's going to put his foot on the pedal. To the middle. And Portis throws it down. And how about breaking out the Statue of Liberty on that dunk? <laughs> a nice way to pad that lead a little more. You're right. And so it's Milwaukee sitting with a comfortable lead up by 14. And we'll see if they can keep up their tremendous shooting. They've been dialed in so far from the field. It's time now to go courtside as we send you over to David Aldridge from the sideline. David, take it away. Thanks very much here with Nick Nurse. Coach, the efficiency wasn't there in the first half. What adjustments do you need to make? I thought we got pretty good shots, you know, and if we're not going to score, it makes getting our defense set up difficult. So you got to keep shooting them. Hopefully start making some of them. Well, you can't score until you shoot, Coach. Thanks. Back to you. All right, Dave, thank you. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow right here on 2K Sports. And now the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Welcome back, everybody. You've been watching the Eastern Conference Finals on 2K Sports. Ernie Johnson, Kenny Smith, and Shaquille O'Neal. Well, for Milwaukee, boy, have they ever started this series off on the right foot. They've thrown down the gauntlet here in game one with their intensity and effectiveness on both ends of the floor. Now, they've got a little bit of an intimidation factor going into the second half. Kenny, your thoughts on the Bucks' first half? There was no shortage of dives on this team. Numerous guys displayed good court vision, moved the ball, led to great shots. They're in full control of this game. And Shaq, what'd you think about Philadelphia? Just bad interior defense from them throughout the half. They couldn't push around, not protecting the rim, allowing easy looks. That's the kind of D I love to face. I haven't had at least 30 by now, guys. And that's all we have for now. Tell the folks goodbye, Shaq. Tell the folks goodbye, goodbye. Kenny. Goodbye. Let's go to Kevin Harlan. Welcome back to Playoff Basketball on 2K Sports. This is the Eastern Conference Final. You look at Ennis Kumbo in this one. He's been everywhere. And with all the pressure he must have felt coming into this one, it didn't phase him one bit. Fantastic start. His performance shows no sign of any nerves. Great job controlling your emotion. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it has been a runaway. The forwards, Harris and Tucker. Tyrese Maxey out there with Harden. And it's Embiid in at the center position. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Now here's Allen. Knocks it loose. Stolen by Tucker. Outside, Maxey. 
And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Well, Maxi goes better at the inside game, basically taking away their good options. For Philadelphia, they have been excellent at the free throw line here today. A flawless six for six. Free throw good, Maxi. A natural scorer who plays with a lot of energy. Maxi, he's going to have a long career. Maxi hits them both. Bucks leading by 12. Beasley, the pass to Anadokounmpo. Middleton with it. The three. A basket good off the assist from Allen. Middleton's got five points so far. Well-rounded effort, and, and they show no signs of letting up. Yeah, not just an impressive showing on offense, but on defense as well, executing their game plan perfectly. And on the screen now is the 2K leaderboard with the rundown of this postseason's assist leader. James Harden, number one, and of course, Drew Holiday. I think these two guys are having a little personal competition here in the playoffs to see who will finish with the most assists. Well, free throw drops for MB. Milwaukee making a switch. Holiday's checked in. That one falls, so he hits both of them. It's always nice to see a big fella be able to knock down some free throws and make teams pay from the line. Here in this third quarter, just over a minute play. There's the triple. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. And the official signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. And just a little too lax with that possession. And it cost him. And if they want to come back in this game, look, they got to clean up those mistakes. Here's Hunter Takumbo. He's got 16. Giannis with the Giannis nice And that bucket adds to what has been a big difference in points in the paint between the two teams. From deep Harden. It's rebounded by Portis. This is the definition of forcing it. He's trying to get himself going, but taking tough shots just won't do it. Outside Holiday. Trying to break that ice cold streak. He takes it up and lays it in. Assisted by. That's now eight points for Drew Holiday. They're doing a really good job of getting the ball inside and attacking the paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Now, here's Maxi. He's got 13. The shot's good. The physical scoring guard, Maxi, is at home on the inside. Middleton against Harris. And he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. Clearly a foul. This is his second trip to the free throw line. Shooting for Milwaukee, Chris Middleton. At the line for two. And that one falls for Middleton. Hamid Bamba, he's checked in for Joel Embiid. And Milwaukee with a change here, too. Simmons is checked in. Middleton hits them both. 
Second half of play with just under two and a half minutes gone. Holiday against Harden. Back to Maxi. Here's the pass to Tucker. Shot clock at five. And the three ball is good. Tucker's got five points so far. Smart pass from the quick thinking Maxi. Outstanding at finding uncovered teammates. Holiday against Harden. On the left block. A shot by Holiday, no good. Well, despite some uneven shooting from him, they're still out in front. Maxi finds Harris. Philadelphia moving the ball around. A step back shot here. Milwaukee with the rebound. Onto the Kumbos got seven rebounds in the game. Maxi against them. Outside for Simmons. Here's Holiday. Second chance shot. No good from Simmons. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. Excellent D. Avoided fouling and got in perfect position to alter that shot. Yeah, there's six points on consecutive three balls. They're finding holes now in the D. Outside Holiday. And to Takumbo. Great positioning on the putback. You want to know why they're winning? It's because of his play offensively. Harden the pass to Maxi. Basket made. That gives him seven field goals and 13 tries. He was just too focused on the hoop. I'm not even sure Maxi felt the defender. Now here's Adedekumbo. He's got 20. Driving inside. Adedekumbo nice. beats the defense again. Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher, and Coach knows it. When it ain't broke, leave it alone until someone stops him, just let him roll. Here's Harris. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Harris has got eight. Now, it's, it's so crazy to me that Harris flies under the radar because he can get buckets all over the court, even with quality defense in his face. 76ers foul. No bomb That's his second personal foul. And a chance for just a second now to check out the scoring breakdown for the Bucks. Their offense has been a well-oiled machine. They're moving the ball around, playing for one another, and just piling up assists. And tonight we've also seen a lot of great play from them inside. They've been consistent in terms of attacking the interior of this D. good on the free throw. I think what makes Giannis special is how uncomplicated he is. The man is just an incredible pure athlete who simply loves the game of basketball. That's all there is to it. Harrell, he's checked in for the 76ers. DeAnthony Melton comes in for Maxi. That one misses. The 76ers trail by 11. Pass to Bamba. Harden against Holiday. Harden kicks to Bamba. Here's Melton. Another three for Philadelphia. Hit works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now oh, here is Holiday. He's got eight over Harden. And the Bucks miss again. Nothing seems to be going his way this quarter. Yeah, straight up, guys. Like, he's ice cold, like freezing. What's colder than cold? But you don't have to shoot it, my guy. It's okay to pass the ball. That's his second personal foul. The 76ers have been made a team. mistake at the line yet. 10 of 10. The line for Philadelphia, DeAnthony Melton. Two shots.
free throw drops for Melton. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. Walker's checked in for the Bucks. Melton hits them both. Milwaukee leading by six. It's out of the Kumbo on the wing. He's defended by Harold. Middleton the pass to Holiday. To the paint. Here's Simmons. It's good. The assist that time from Holiday. Assist from Holiday's got his fourth assist in this one. Nice feed inside. Saw the play develop and hit him right when he needed to. Now here's Harden. He's got 11. Pass to Bamba. Kicks it to Harold. Good ball movement here by the 76ers. Here's Melton. They get it again. And the shot is good. The Bucks lead has been cut down to just six points in the bucket from Bamba. Yeah, and this is something Bamba does so well. Unbelievable recognition and timing to come up with offensive rebound. Now here's Simmons. He's got 13. Bamba with the block. In the corner, it's Melton. And the dunk by Bamba. That seven-foot nine wingspan on full display there. Bamba swooping in at the four. Now against Young. And they call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. Second personal foul. And he's caught fire this quarter yet to miss a shot. So far in the game, he's all of two at the line. A different look for Milwaukee. Jay Crowder's checked in for Chris Middleton. And it's Beasley in for Drew Holiday. throw good on him, and Philadelphia calls time here and the lack of rim protection top of the list I'm sure coach is going to give them an earful about that he can't be happy with that soft interior D and here's Melton he'll bring it up for the 76 year seven point differential Pass to Harden. Poked loose and stolen by Simmons. Oh, the lob for Simmons. A high to stuff the alley. And how about the connection Simmons has with his guys? Once the lob is on its way, you know he's going to finish in style. Now here's Harold. Still yet to score. Bamba kicks to Melton. Simmons with the defensive effort. You know what? He's just stone cold right now. Really not sure if he's their best option offensively as they try to get back in this game. Launches a three. Good on that shot. With that, the Bucks lead is cut down to just six points with the basket for Melton. Yeah, that's too good a look to give them from behind the arc. And it's Walker penetrating. Here's Crowder. A stupendous finish in traffic. Stayed with it, and his effort is rewarded with the second chance bucket. Philadelphia has gone 4 of 6 from three point land since the start of the second half. Amba finds Milt. And the rejection by Adekumbo. And that's a foul Malik called Beasley. on Malik Beasley. That's his second. That'll be his second foul. foul of the game. Four. Reed is checked in for Philadelphia. Now into the lineup for your 76ers, Paul Reed. The pass to Melton. Back to Reed. Six on the shot clock. On the wing, Harden. Fires the three. 
Rebound, Yano sent to Kumbo. On to Kumbo. He's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Well, there's so little ego in Giannis's game. It's not about him out there. He wants to make the game easier for his teammates. Here is Harden following the bucket by the Bucks. This one for three. Buries it from three-point range. Harden's got six points in the quarter. Boy, they've been terrific from beyond here in the second. To the inside. Simmons. And Simmons slams it in. <laughs> and at his size, all Simmons needs is primetime positioning. And he's going a fantastic dunker. And Philadelphia calls time here. They have to like what we're seeing from Giannis under the Kumbo. Well, he's been destroying them inside, and they need a timeout to figure out an answer or a prayer if there is one. And the 76ers making a change here. Embiid's checked in, and Milwaukee with a change here, too. Portis is checked in for Malik Beasley. Good on that shot. With that, the Bucks' lead is cut down to just six points with the basket from Tucker. Simmons again, Tartan. And the shot's good from Crowder. And they're passing the ball very crisply here. Philadelphia has gotten a positive outcome on seven of their 14 three-pointers in this game. Not bad at all. 13 feet away. Harden, no good. Yeah, and he had the D tangled up there with that patented crossover. Just couldn't convert the finish. The Anthony Melton picks up the foul. That's foul number two for him. Yeah, clearly he had an established position there. And there's a minute 45 left to play here in the third. Outside Crowder. Shot clock at six. And he uses the glass on the way. And now it's a 10-point Bucks lead. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Elton finds Embiid. And there it is for him. Embiid's got four this quarter. Milwaukee has gone one of three from downtown since halftime. Giannis outside. And uh, 101 left in the third quarter of the game. Lays it up off the glass. And they are attacking the rim and getting great results. Passes it to Tucker. Back to Harden. And again, it's Philadelphia. And not relying at all on the three-point shot. Uh, they may want to rethink about stretching the defense a bit like they did in that first half. Now oh, here's Simmons. 17 points in the game. And the wide open shot from Crowder. And it's good assisting on the play with Simmons. Simmons got four assists now tonight. Simmons against Harden from past the arc. A rebound by the Bucks. 17 points was their biggest margin. Well, his shooting is unfortunately not a big thing. And his lackluster accuracy is probably the thing that's keeping them behind. Giannis outside. From outside the arc. That one, no good. And here at the end of the third quarter, it's a double-digit ball game. With the score, Milwaukee on top, up by 11. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with his feet. They had no chance to prevent that basket. That's an unguardable pass flat out. Give him credit for possessing that type of vision. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters on the court for the Bucks. 
Holiday and Allen are their guards. 76 Chris Middleton is out there with Jay Crum. And it's Portis in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Well, I'll tell you what, he earned his money on that foul. Shooting for Milwaukee, Bobby Portis taking two shots. And he makes the first. And Portis drains both of them. The 76ers trail by 13. And here's Melton. Down low. Stolen by Middleton. And it's Halliday at the elbow. Bamba with the block. The main thing you get with Bamba, imposing defender, shot blocker, alters everything in the paint. Harris against Halliday. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. That one is on holiday. Philadelphia, Tobias Harris. That free throw, no good. A swing man that scores on all three levels. Harris is about as consistent as it gets. And he's good on the second. Bucks leading by 12. Allen left side. Portis trying to free himself. Allen shot is off. And thus far, they've managed to overcome an off game from him offensively. Stolen by Holiday. We played just over one minute here in the fourth quarter. Portis finds Middleton. Back to Portis. Maxi against Allen. And Embiid with the block. And he gets it back. Maxi against Allen. Now, here's Maxi. He's covered closely, and the layup is good. This is why so many, including myself, are excited about Maxi's future, showing how phenomenal of a scorer he can be. Now, here is Holiday. Crowder, he blocks it again. A, a defensive stalwart Walking so ball. far. That's six blocks. Greg it's protecting the, the rim. Love Malik the hustle. Beasley. Malik Beasley, he's checked in for Crowder. Free basketball up to that point. That's the only time he's turned it over so far. The 76ers trail by 10. Last quarter of play, about two minutes in now. Feeds to Harris. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. And Beasley has the ball here for the Bucks. They've played a great fourth quarter defensive, allowing only three points. Three-point three shooting since the half has been about as good as you could ask for. And here are the 76ers now, following the three by Milwaukee. Here's Maxi, Lays it up and banks it in. Maxi's got four points now in the quarter. I 
I like the intention. The oh, focus oh. finding a way to make it work inside. Timeout called the Bucks. And team strategies closely guarded. One aspect of the game the fans aren't always privy to. And we see it so often. One little tweak to the game plan and everything falls into place for a team. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Alden. David. Hey, guys, here was Adrian Griffith's message during the huddle. He said nobody thought we'd be in this position right now, and we are. He said he was proud of his guys, and he also said, now go finish this thing off and get this win. Kevin? Thank you, David. The lead now in single digits. Well, after an uneven first half, he's managed to right the ship and get things going. Melton against Howard. To the paint. There's Portis. The D by Embiid. The 76ers trail by nine. Harris looking it over. Here's Maxi Again, Philadelphia. Recognize the D is closing in. Maxi letting it go. And the Bucks, they're shooting at 50% in a decent group. Bamba against Middleton. Now here is Holiday. He's guarded closely. Just five to shoot. Here's the three. And it's Joel Embiid with the rebound. There has been nothing for him this quarter. Ever since halftime, he's lost all of his touch. Harris against Beasley. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. Beasley. Good job by Harris. Personal the contact right there, making the D send him to the line. At the line for your Sixers, Tobias Harris. And the first one at the line is good. And the Bucks making a change here. Onto the Kumbos checked in. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Bucks leading by five. And looks like back. the illegal pick was set. Steve yep, Porter. that's right. That'll get their attention. Third Beyond third. the leaning, you could see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. Well, guys get away with this all the time, but on this occasion, he got caught. Now, here's Bamba. Back to Maxi. Here's Embiid. Joel Embiid. Two picks. The adjustments they've made offensively in putting guys in a position now to succeed. And it took them a little while to get there. Just goes to show as long as, long as you persevere, you'll figure your way out. And that shot was huge as they tried to stem the tide here and hang on to the lead. Holiday against Melton. It goes in, and the Milwaukee lead is cut down to three points. Nice bucket there from Maxi. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. That one on Harris. A determined shooter who excels at the charity strike. Middleton will gladly head to the line. Two shots. And he knocks down the first one. Harrell, he's checked in for Mohamed Bamba. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. The 76ers trail by five. Outside, Maxi launches it, curls it from outside. 
Maxey's got 17 now, just in the second half. And for record or small feet, I have to imagine it was a topic of discussion at halftime. And you see this so much more nowadays in the NBA. Teams putting a larger emphasis on jacking up threes. Maxey kicks to Embiid. Maxey with it. And the foul called on Antetokounmpo. That's his first foul. James Harden, he's checked in for the 76ers. Third team foul. Now into the lineup for your 76er. James Harden. Embiid against Portis. Yep, it goes in, and the Milwaukee lead is cut down to just two points with the bucket from James Harden. Fighting for those points, the beer playing tough. Holiday, the pass to Middleton. Nice ball to win by Milwaukee. Portis, it hits the bead. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Embiid. at six. Here's Giannis. Inside. Giannis onto the Kumbo. Automatic. They're in strong position coming down the stretch and he is a big reason why. Harden kicks to Maxi. Headshot off. Excellent D there from Allen. And so it's Middleton with it. He brings it up for the Bucks. 17 points was their biggest margin. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. This is why he's out there. In situations like this, he stands tall to prevent points. You gotta love his hustle. Leaving the defense, no time to react. And all of a sudden, that man was just on the other end. Wow. Here's Giannis. After the basket by Montrez Hero. Giannis, no good. The 76ers trail. Maxi on the wing. Pass to Embiid. Back to Maxi. To tie it up. The rebound by the Bucks. Giannis out zone. He kicks to Holiday. Back to Giannis. Rebound by Harold. Harrell's got six rebounds now in the game. Harden surveying the D. That doesn't go on the chance to tie. Milwaukee's gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. Bounce pass out of the Kumbo. Harden against Holiday. It's good. Really? And the Bucks lead by four. Able to absorb contact. Holiday is not someone that is prone to lose focus on these tough takes. And Philadelphia calls time here. You have to like what we're seeing from Giannis out of the Kumbo. And whatever the D has thrown at him, he's had an answer. His offense is coming naturally to him because he keeps things simple. You hear that, people? Keeps things simple. And now, let's take a look at the new balance player of the game. Giannis out of the Kumbo. And what an amazing ball game we've seen from him. It's been a one-man show worth the price of admission all by itself. There wasn't anything he couldn't do on that court tonight. Now here's Embiid. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Embiid's got four this quarter. The list of guys who have led the league in points and assists, well, it's a short one. That includes James Harden, LeBron, Will Prosper, amongst others. Here's Simmons. Up and in Drew on the way. Holiday. 14 this points for Drew Holiday. Ben Simmons. Hey, guys, all about hard work from this point on. They, they worked hard to create that high-quality shot and then able to knock it down. Now here is Harris. Milwaukee with the rebound. Andre DeCumbo has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. In the corner, Harden. Back 
Pass to Tucker. Outside, Maxi. He's looking for Embiid and finds him. Through the net again. He's done that 10 times tonight. And he's only needed 11 shots to get there. The guy you want to have the ball. Embiid, this man is a superstar. Timeout called the Bucks. Philadelphia, please welcome the court your Sixers ENT. as I post. He's against Tucker. Here's Middleton. And it's good. Two points. Middleton. Middleton's got nine points here in the second half. And the pressure just doesn't get to Middleton. In fact, he enjoys embraces it. Loves the opportunity to take the big shot. Embiid, no good. Bucks leading by four. Simmons finds Holiday. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. There's the lob. There's Giannis. Look out below. And one of the most athletic players in the league. Giannis makes those alley-oop jams look easy. And the against Simmons. 139 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Six to shoot. Harden gets the bucket. Few guys can be as trusted as Harden when you're in these situations. He knows how to get it done. Now oh, here's Young. The strength, the might, Giannis. And that's just cold blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. This is what you expect from him. Just coming alive and dominating in effortless fashion here in the fourth. Embiid, the rebound by the Bucks. Simmons got his eighth rebound here tonight. Over in the corner, Allen. Here's Giannis. Rebound by the 76ers. Well, I'll give him an A for effort for trying to go through the defense, but maybe he should ease up on that one just a little bit. Now, here's Tucker. Tries from 10. Harris trying to get free. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Tobias Harris. That's his second personal foul. Third team foul. Over in the corner, Allen. Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. And that is the kind of big-time shot that can really deflate a crowd. And, and did he ever do that? Sound level right now, zero in this arena. And Philadelphia calls time here. They're behind by nine. The the court. There's 38 seconds left in the fourth. Guys, your thoughts? I mean, it's iffy that there's enough time to even get a quick shot and a foul. Catching up on the changes for Philadelphia. Bomba is checked in for Joel Embiid. Reed comes in for Tobias Harris. And it's DeAnthony Melton in for Maxi. And then for Milwaukee, Jay Crowder comes in for Antetokounmpo. And it's Lonnie Walker in for Chris Middleton. Here's Holiday. James Harden picking up that last basket. Walker surveying the floor. Banked in off the glass. Lonnie Walker the floor. And the Bucks lead by nine. And it's just competing. And, you know, giving your best when it matters most. And let me tell you, as a team, you will have to keep your stride right at the crucial moment. They put this game away in style. And so they choose to intentionally foul. James Harden. That's his first personal foul. Fourth team foul. At the line for the Bucks, Drew Holiday. Taking two shots. and that makes it a seven-point lead. Six. 
Second one is good. Getting both at the line. And it's an eight point game. And the 76ers call time here. They're trailing by eight. Six seconds left here in the fourth quarter. And the Sixers youth. That's me. Let's hear it for your 76ers youth dance team. The three from Harden. Laces one from three. Coming up big in the clutch. Harden, you know he loves these moments. And so the Bucks take the win. A uh, pretty good feeling right now for them to be out in front like this in the series. You see, Kevin, momentum is so, so critical. Sure and you know safe. they'll want to we ride this wave into again. game two. And now, let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline for our player of the game. David, take it away. Thanks very much. Giannis, you have said in the past you have even more untapped potential. So how did you put your fingerprints on this game? I'm just here to do whatever it takes to help my team win. Did a great job executing, moving the ball. And uh, this is what we do. This is what we do. We play together, and uh, whatever we do, hopefully we can get a win at the end of the day. Well, it certainly turned into a win tonight, man. Thanks. Back to you guys. David, thank you as always. And so this one is in the books. We hope you've enjoyed being with us for the Eastern Conference Finals. This is Kevin Harlan saying thank you for watching. We'll see you later.